Destiny. Oh, hi. Oh. Take this out. Destiny. Oh, uh, I just needed to rant a little bit about Destiny. Yes, I rant about it. He hates it. I put three solid weeks into it. I mean, it's a uh, level 28. Level 30 is max right now. But. That's pretty hard. To get to it, I did. I did. There's a couple things you can do. You can do the strikes, mm -hmm. and you can do uh, the raid, mm -hmm. and you can do, I guess, the street things. PvP. PvP is awesome. It's fun. It reminds me of Halo a lot. I like it. I mean, obviously, it's Bungie. They made Halo. Yeah. They there don't have freaking Team SWAT. Bungie, Bungie! They should but, stick to what they're good at. Uh, Seriously. Um, like story? Yeah. Yeah? They're pretty good at story. Yeah, they are. Yeah, then, Bungie didn't have story. They don't know what story is. Apparently. They didn't put it. They didn't Not put much. Destiny. Didn't have any story. It was, it was like, I, you know, I'm gonna wake you up, and here you go, going on these missions, and then you go on your missions. What you do is you have your guy. It's not rushed at all. You, you put him out. You say, you do something on this computer, and he says, "Oh, fucking learn." You kill everybody in the room, protect them, and then you move on. And then you do the same thing again, and then again, and then again. Basically, it's <laughs> What you're saying is, it's World of Warcraft with guns, with no story. It, yeah, it's pretty bad. Yeah, that's stupid. I don't even want Graphics to are great. The music's fucking the music is so good, man. It's so Halo. I feel like it got rushed, dude. I feel uh, like got rushed. I'm so pissed off they fucking fired Mario Donald. It's bullshit. It's very angry. I, I hope it goes back to 343. Come on. Uh, it is rushed. At the end of the game, you finally. Okay, what pisses me off? Me and Matt are playing it. Oh, actually, I did this on my own. Uh, I beat the game. It gets to this part, and this girl's like, I can tell you so much more about everything that's going on. Like, oh my god, she's gonna tell me shit. She's gonna tell me shit. And she's like, but I can't right now. She walks off, and you're just like, Halo 2 all over again. You didn't finish the game. This brings me to Halo 2. I love Halo 2. Fucking love Halo 2, especially the multiplayer. Well, I knew it was but gonna be a trilogy, though. Halo 2. No, no, no. <laughs> you don't know the story about Halo 2, do you? Huh. When they were making Halo 2, they had a whole Earth, like, a whole Earth, like, third of the game chopped out. You know how he says, I need a weapon. Oh, no, no, he says, sir, I'm finishing this fight. And it yeah. just ends. Yeah. They had a whole other part of Halo 2 that was him going to Earth and finishing out this huge battle. That was, that was what the Halo 2 was, but they were on a schedule. Microsoft pushed them. And they had to put out what they had. Yeah, that's bad, folks. Don't do it. Plus, the demo they had at E3, which everybody fucking blew up about. They pulled the dual weapons, jumping in the Oh, yeah, no, was, Man, yeah. that was so awesome. Yeah. That was supposed to be a level in the game. They said it was. It wasn't. It was just a demo, and they yeah. really regretted doing that. Yeah, I remember that. Yeah, that looked really cool, and yeah, they just didn't deliver. So crazy. <laughs> I love how we started talking about Destiny Now. We're it's kind of... Back to Halo 2, because it's coming out in Master Chief Collection, so... You know, they got to do what they promised. <sighs> They, Most game developers don't. The, another thing that happened that makes me pissed off, there's so many people that wouldn't even... They signed contracts, but some people came out on the line and leaked it. A year ago, when they were playing, they had three... There's three different people you could be in the game, and they had stories for all of them. You started off, when you picked that class, you would go through the story arc, and look for each one. And I think, for time constraints, DLC, they're with Activision, you know Call of Duty, it's fucking... You already know they're... You're, they're just gonna try to make more money off it, milk it for everything. But... Yeah. Bungie cut out a lot. You can tell. It's... It doesn't rushed. feel like a Bungie game. It's there's rushed. a lot of things that do feel like a Bungie game, but it's rushed. Yeah, there's there's no... They need the story. Mm -hmm. They should have made a game with a very solid story and then had it go on. Yeah. We didn't get that. I don't know. It wasn't open world or anything. I feel like I thought it was going to be... Like, you can't not, communicate with people. It's just not as good as I thought it would be. When you want to raid, you have to have three people let you know that want to play. You know how fucking hard that is for somebody my age? No one wants to play. How, no, not like none of my friends own next gen systems either. Yeah, it's dumb. You can't communicate. The only way you communicate is that like I have an Xbox right now. You have to like go through like the list. Like, oh, I see somebody that's my level. Click, click, go through it, send them a message. Please play with me. What the fuck is that? Stupid, dumb systems. <sighs> it isolates me. I don't know. Good job. That's just my thought on it. I think. Way to go, Bungie. They let me down. Yep. Fail. Fail. Have a good day. Have a good day, everybody. Yep. Hi. Hi, hi. Hi. You gonna cut this out? Hi. You gonna cut it out? Yeah. Okay. Take this out. Yeah.